So the WIN method, W-I-N, what exactly does that stand for as it applies to our tennis? WIN, W-I-N, is an acronym for what's important now, okay? What's important now? Now this is a very, very useful thing. If you're a type of person that has a hard time letting go of errors and you're not a really good thinker on the court, I've sat with tons and tons of players after the match whether they're adult players or junior players, and after the match, they seem to be able to tell me very clearly all the things they could have done and should have done, but something about being in the heat of battle and out there competing, they don't think so straight. So if you're a person who tends to get angry or nervous or any of those uh, thoughts that aren't really the best, what's important now is a great uh, acronym to think about, and I want to teach you and show you how we do it on the court here with Marty and Carly, and this is really something you should be asking yourselves almost ever almost after every single point. What's important now? It's a great little way to keep yourself focused in the present and giving yourself the best chance to win. So let's hit the courts with Marty and Carly. So we know as tennis players compete, and I know this from coaching for so many years, that after a match, maybe after a loss, it's really easy to kind of say, maybe not right after, but a, a little bit, a couple hours later, it's easy to kind of come up with all the things you should have done. It's thinking out on the court during competition in the heat of battle that kind of gets cloudy, the, you know, kind of the fog of war. Mm -hmm. So when, um, what's important now is just a little trick that you do to yourself. When you feel yourself getting agitated and maybe frustrated, you just go to that and you ask yourself what's important now. Now you may not know, but this is good for training for you. So what's important now is you've got to come up with an answer for that. So right now you're playing, you're not necessarily behind, but I want you to play some points. And every once in a while I'm going to say, what's important now? Based on what's happening with the score, uh, the situation, how you're playing, what the score is in the set or the game even, I'm going to say, tell me what's important now. Tell me what's important now. That's a, that, that's a very effective way to kind of reduce stress and it gets your focus from, instead of the winning, it brings you to present focus because it's real easy to think about the past or the future, you know, and this gets you in the, this whole thing, what's important now, boom, and now, that's now, it's the present, okay? Mm -hmm. So go ahead, every couple of games or every couple of points, I'm going to ask you to tell me what's important now. Go ahead, guys, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start you in a tiebreaker because I want you to have a scoring thing. And you're finishing up this tiebreaker and the score is three all. And if I could uh, make a scenario here, this is the world championship. Whoever gets this gets $1,000. Ready? Three all in the tiebreaker. Okay, good. So Coach Marty, your mom, you're going to go ahead and serve next, all right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yep, a tiebreaker halfway through it. Okay, good. All right. So, Marty, now let's time out. What's the score? Um, I'm now up five three. Five three. She's up. So, what's important now? Um, being consistent or playing to win. Let's okay, say. playing to win. So you don't back up. You got to lead now. Going, All right. Aggressive. What's important now? Good answer. Swing away. Keep going. Okay. Now what? What's important? This next point. Um. Not to think about the backhand I just missed. Right, just dump the backhand return, kind of an unforced error. Yeah, not to be right. afraid. That's always what my partner tells me. In yeah, don't stuff. be afraid. Four or five? Okay, good. You can pretty much ask yourself this question after every point. And if you're a person that gets angry between points or mind wanders between points, it's a nice little trick. Okay, so the score is? Um, six, or six, four. Six, four. What's important now? You got a set point, right? Mm -hmm. Closing it out. Closing it out. How are you going to play this? Uh, making my first serve. All right. So I'm going to put it in the first serve. Okay, good. And I noticed you stuck with your personal promise there. All right, good. Not bad. So why do I love that acronym? What's important now? Most people between points do a lot of poor thinking. That's when their private voice can get bad. You can see between points more so than during points. People's body posture goes south. So as soon as that point ends, if you can get in the habit of asking yourself what's important now, it'll help you stay focused. It'll help you get a better game plan. And I find that sometimes when I do this with players, they don't know. So you might have to get some coaching along the way, maybe some strategic coaching to know what's important now. But one thing we do know 
that's not important is to act up, to get angry, to show frustration. Okay, so what's important now, the WIN acronym is a really good way to kind of help you reduce your fear because it gets you in the present instead of thinking about the future and past and maybe you're angry or nervous.